Old pirates, they rob I. These are songs for an unusual audience. Today, 10 News was invited inside Donovan State Prison for really a unique performance. And new at 530, reporter Joe Little was there to see how it hopes to inspire the inmates who could one day be your neighbor. I hurt myself today. It's a somber song for what you'd expect to be a somber crowd. What have I become? But Robert Byrd wants people to feel the emotion. When you pick up the guitar, an acoustic guitar, you start playing it, you feel it resonate through your body. Resonate through your body, your mind, and your heart. Maybe a hard sell, especially for lifers like Sean Khalifa. I was a part of a burglary, and my co-defendants unfortunately attacked the homeowner, and he did die. Khalifa and dozens of Donovan correctional inmates are here to listen and be inspired by Wayne Kramer. But for a few years, I was known as 00180190. A prisoner himself in the 70s. Old pirates, they rob I. Now a legendary guitarist who spreads the love of music through his program, Jail Guitar Doors. He brought his talent. None of them can stop time. And 12 new Fender guitars for the inmates. These guitars represent a challenge. Sign up for our songwriting workshop program. Amazing things will happen. Amazing things through music. Redemption song. It's easy to connect with, and you make a powerful connection with making music directly yourself. Kramer's gift allows instructors like Robert Byrd to teach the inmates how to play. Teach them how to express themselves. Emotions like pain, fear, and happiness. You can't unlearn music. That's one of the things that keeps me going is that I notice an extraordinary change. A change that can prepare Khalifa for life beyond these walls. He's been behind them for 14 years. I think if I keep working and maturing, I'll have a chance. A chance to be free Away. by letting the music resonate through his heart. There you go. Inside Donovan Correctional, Joe Little, 10 News. This was the first time Wayne Kramer has performed at Donovan Correctional, but it's the 100th time he's played for inmates. Four